You're now tuned into the Lady Charmaine Live Show, and I'm your host, Lady Charmaine. And as always, I have another great interview for you today. Now, when you think of shows like Ugly Betty, The Fosters, or even Rosewood, or how about one of our favorites, Orange is the New Black? Well, this person just might come to mind. And I tell you who it is coming up right after this. My guest today is a SAG and Critic Choice Award winner, and she has shocked audiences on the Smash original Netflix series, Orange is the New Black. And she also starred alongside Morris Chestnut in the Fox series, Rosewood. And she is back today to talk about her new NBC series, The Village, and her new film in theaters now, Fast Colors. Help me welcome back to the Lady Charmaine live show, Miss Lorraine Toussaint. Welcome back to the show. Thank you, Charmaine. Thank you. <laughs> now, you know, it's always a pleasure having you on the show. You were on when um, you were on Rosewood. You came on twice, and now you're back. You got a brand new series and a new film in theaters now. So I want to talk to you first about the new film, Fast Colors. Tell us about it and the character that you play. Uh, Fast Colors is about four generations of, um, <clears throat> of women with unusual abilities mm. uh, who've been hiding out for fear of persecution. And uh, my daughter, who's been away for eight years, uh, has run into some serious trouble and is is on the run. She comes home, brings the trouble home, and you watch these, these three women, uh, played by myself, Gugum Bafa Ra and Sanaya Sydney. You watch these three women, who is only 12, mm -hmm. come together in order to survive. Wow, amazing. Because you have been very busy. You know, I love everything that you do. And then I've been watching you on The Village because I love that as well. But I had a question for you before we go, um, before I ask you my next question. Are there any other projects that you're working on? Because I know The Village is great. And I'm like, okay, what else is she working on? I'm going to find out. I want to get the scoop first. <laughs> so what you got going on? Yeah. <laughs> um, I've got The Village, which is um, tonight. Mm -hmm. uh, it's tonight on, on Tuesday night. Uh, at 8 o'clock, I've got um, uh, Into the Badlands, which I shot in Ireland. Mm -hmm. okay. season, season 3 and 4, which is on AMC. That's on Monday night. Um, I've got Fast Color. I just finished a biopic called um, The Glorias, directed by Julie Taymor. Mm -hmm. And that'll be out later this year. Uh, I've wrapped... Um, uh, scary stories, Guillermo, Ter Guillermo de Toro, del Toro, scary stories. Um, I know I'm forgetting a few in there also. Uh, I'm the voice of, of Shadow Weaver on the animated series Shira. Uh, I know there's one or two films in there that I know, I know I've forgotten. But, uh, I've been busy. I've been busy. <laughs> Absolutely. Now, that's a good problem to have. When you have so many projects, you can even remember some of them. That's a good problem. I'm, to I'm telling you, isn't that, isn't that nice? <laughs> that is amazing. Well, you know, I've been watching The Village. I love it. One thing I love about The Village is it's people that come together from all different backgrounds under one building in this apartment complex. You have a woman from Afghanistan, of course. It's you and your husband, an African-American couple. You have a gentleman that was in the military who was injured in the military. Then you have an old war vet in there who's with his grandson i mean you have lawyers i mean and, and then you also have the the mother with the teenage daughter that's having a baby as well it is so many stories that's wrapped up in there with all the lives so i would just want you to tell us from your standpoint about the show and let everybody know the character that you play well you pretty much laid out the show <laughs> and i'll just tell you about my character i play patricia Davis, who is uh, she's the heart of the building. She's she's lived here the longest, and uh, my husband Ron is the super. We own a little bar, also. But Patricia is a she's a social worker, so she's she is a people person. Mm -hmm. She's a caregiver, a caretaker, and so she's the one that everyone comes to for for you know all sorts of reasons: uh, good times, bad times, 
advice fun times uh, and uh, you watch Patricia over the course of the first season certainly um, some terms with her own challenges mm-hmm. she, she has the diagnosis and kept her and so this village she's going to need the support of this village as much as she has been giving support mm-hmm Absolutely. And it's something how the givers, you know, always have people in need. And now it's your time on the show that you are in need. So when you really start opening up about what you're going through, just oh, I can't wait to see how the village comes together uh, for you. So, Miss Lorraine, OK, when you're not working, because as you just told us, your resume earlier <laughs> and everything you got going on this year, when you're not working, what can we find you doing your Lorraine me time? I'm a mom. You'll find me doing laundry. You'll find me cooking. You'll find me shopping my child. You'll find me waiting for my child. Okay. Uh, uh, I try to I try to get some me time in there somewhere, but um, uh, probably no different than most working mothers who are, you know, working and, and have a family. Uh, so I'm, you know, that's my that's my primary focus is my daughter mm-hmm. and my work and um, I am a gardener when I can get to it I'm living in New York City now so that's kind of tough mm-hmm. um, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a great cook I love to cook it's very relaxing I do a lot of it I try to cook almost every day because uh, then I know what's going into my family's mouth mm-hmm. <laughs> and um, uh, um I I am a writer. I um I love to peruse museums and old antique shops. And oh. I I love wandering through antique places. Um I like objects with resonance. <laughs> um so uh, I'm uh, I'm I'm I try to get some downtime but there hasn't been a whole lot of it lately. But that's okay. Since you say you're a cook, well, what's one of your favorite dishes that you like to cook? I can cook almost anything. Mm-hmm. I'm, I'm good. I, I do great different fishes. I do, um, I can do beef. I do lamb. I do oxtails. Okay. I can cook soap. I can cook um, <laughs> uh, pretty much all seafood, lobster, shrimp. Uh, I do some pastas. I do Caribbean food. I I can do Asian food. I do Thai food. Okay. I, I, I can cook. It's a no. It's not like you can throw down. That, that, that's what I hear coming from you. I, I can. I can. I can throw down now. I can throw down. Take, take, take time to throw down, but uh, I can throw down. Yeah. I know that's right. Well, Miss Lorraine, I want to remind the audience first to make sure that you tune into the Village tonight on NBC nine eight Central. It's always a pleasure having you on the show, and I look forward to definitely having you back. I thank you so much. It's been a pleasure. Absolutely. Thank you. And don't forget to tune in to tonight to The Village on NBC, 9, 8 Central. Check out Miss Lorraine Toussaint. It is a show that is so intertwined that you might see yourself in some of these characters. So I want to make sure that everybody tunes in tonight because I'll be in front of the TV. So will you be watching with me? Again, I want to say thank you to my very special guest, Miss Lorraine Toussaint.